Newsnight tonight at 8, police are searching for the suspects who fired several rounds in front of a busy McDonald's. The shooting injuring six people, including a six-year-old little girl. It happened at the corner of University Avenue and Bay Road in East Palo Alto, and that's where we find Crown Force Scott Rates. He is live. Horace Scott, what are police telling you? Well, Vicki, I just checked with police. They tell me right now they are still searching for two suspects who they say opened fire right in front of this busy McDonald's store. Let me show you what's going on right now. They just cleared the scene out here. They have just reopened Bay Road right in front of this McDonald's store. Now, I want to go right over to some video. This is what it looked like just a couple hours ago. Police were quickly called out here. They searched the area using canines. According to investigators, the suspects fired at least 12 shots out of a car hitting five people who were waiting at a bus stop in front of that McDonald's. One person that was injured was a six-year-old girl. She was just trying to run away. She was not hit by a bullet, but she was hurt as she was trying to run away. I am also told that that six-year-old's grandmother was one of the victims who was struck by a bullet. Now, I did speak to two different witnesses out of here. They didn't want to give me their name, but they described to me what they saw. I heard it from my house, my friend's house, but she, my girlfriend told me exactly what happened, and I had like f five minutes that I left them here, and I heard them, so I just came over here, and that's when they told me, and they were calling me. And you heard the gunshots? Though? Yeah. What it sound like? Like hella weird. I don't know. Yeah, that was scary. And right now, there is no motive for the shooting. Police do say they are looking into the possibility that this was gang-related. No word uh, on the victims right now. No word if any of those victims were targeted. As far as the suspects, police only saying they're looking for two young Hispanic men. Now, I did check, and I can tell you that the six people who were injured were taken to Stanford Medical Center. All of them tonight expected to be okay. Reporting live in East Palo Alto, Scott Rates, Front 4 News.